Hey ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of the YouTube world, we are back with Batman the Telltale Series, Episode 3. This is Part 2. Let's see what we're about to get into. Let's get it. Close the secret door. Put this in my pocket so nobody knows. Mr. Wayne. Bruce. Open up. What do you mean, open up? It's my office. I thought maybe you left. Yeah, right. <sighs> well, the board has voted. And have they sent the chairwoman to wield the axe? You're being asked to step down from your position as CEO. I mean, nice. Effective immediately. At least until this whole mess gets cleaned up. We were out of options, I'm afraid. All right. I get it. My name isn't great for business lately. I'm sorry, Bruce. It's not your fault. I asked to slow all this down, but... The press release is going out as we speak. There will be a public event in the morning where you will formally announce your resignation. Fantastic. I'm sorry, Bruce. I tried to fight for you. The board believes this is the only logical course of action. I, I really appreciate it. you trying, Regina. Thanks. Don't mention it. Our stock is tanking. The board is losing confidence. Wayne Enterprises needs a new face. They already had a candidate in mind. I thought it was... <clears throat> I was outvoted. Remember, he'd only be interim CEO. Just until this mess gets cleared up. And who would that be? Who exactly would that be? Oswald. Oh! Oswald. Bruce, oh hell no! Good to see you again. I ain't hugging you. What a chilly greeting. Don't touch me. As you know, Oswald's parents were, well, Victims of your father's actions. This company was built on the land he stole from the Cobblepot family. Well, the board thought having me step in would be a good PR move. What better way to show Gotham that Wayne Enterprises is committed to righting the wrongs of the past? Happy to help any way I can. People aren't much behind the Wayne name now. I hear you've been keeping yourself pretty busy, Oswald. You sure you can handle this? I mean, wasn't there a revolution that you had to handle? I'm a brilliant multitasker. I bet. The board has complete confidence in Mr. Cobblepot. As his resume goes into great detail, his endeavors in England have been quite successful. Besides, the company basically runs itself at this point. The CEO is mostly a figurehead. Don't make this harder than it has to be. Hmm. I'm gonna be subtle. Well, then I guess congratulations are in order. I'll be subtle. Nice to know you'll be the one trapped in this tiny office all day. Oh, I'm sure it's bigger than it looks. I'm what do you mean by that? I need you to leave the building immediately. We'll have your personal effects sent to you. All right. Fine by me. Congratulations, Bruce. I couldn't be prouder of you, Alfred. Oh, yes. how sweet. Graduation present. Sound like that. Surely we could let him take this along. Okay. Oh, Bruce. Clumsy, clumsy. No wonder you're not being trusted with nice things anymore. Okay. I'll call someone in to clean that up. <laughs> It'll only take a minute. <laughs> oh, Bruce and I can handle Don't worry. No, I'll clean his chin. <laughs> Bruce! I need security in here. I'll right clean now. his chin. No, what was that this is a for? disaster. What was that for? <laughs> you want a replay? This. Oh, oh I'll you. give you a replay. Calm down. Not nah, after that. Give it all. <laughs> give him the left. Get him out of my office. Let's go. I'm so sorry, Mr. Cobblepot. I'll go fetch the medic. That's very kind of you, Regina. <laughs> I gave him the right, then I gave him the left. I wasn't playing. You dropped. Oh, oh. Your mistake? Okay. You get somebody clean that up, I'll clean your chin. No problem. No problem. No 
problem. Y'all can get off me. Bruce. Lucius. They're out of their minds. They can't do this to you. This isn't over yet, Lucius. The entrance. I took care of it. I got it. You can't let anyone find out what's down there, Bruce. There are ways they could get in. You know that. Hold me down. Think you can keep an eye on things while I'm gone? I... I don't know. Lucius, I need to know there's someone I can trust on the inside. I'm here for you, Bruce. I've always been here for you, not them. If I stay, I'll have to stop working on our side project. That means no new tech, no repairs if you need them. I could keep an eye on things for you. Let you know what they're up to. Feed you what information I can. I need no, that. Lucius, I need you to stay here. I need that. But you're the only ally I have in this building. It's important. I need you to be my eyes and ears. Please. All right, I can do that. Keep Oswald out of R&D. Let me know if anything comes up. I need that, my brother. Keep Appreciate that you. drive safe. Oh, well. Don't worry about me, bro. Bro, me, no, I'll go. So I'm kicked out as CEO. Bruce Wayne Penguin is taking over. Issue at a press event tomorrow Great. morning, where we'll learn more about his decision to step down. More on that in a moment. It wasn't my decision. I still can't believe it. Which part? I wish life were easier for you, Bruce. Hmm. It's just one thing after another. Yeah, I wouldn't mind easy for a change. Someday. Hopefully. With the children of Arkham accessing Wayne Tech, I have to figure out what their next move is. Let's check this drive. Bring up a searchable network of all possible electronic traffic related to Wayne Enterprises. If the children of Arkham are in our system, all of this is potentially accessible. All of this? Lucius was very thorough. It means that they could have eyes and ears into almost everything in Gotham. Just like Batman. They had access to the GCBD, we know that. The real question is, what else they'd be interested in? Filter for possible targets based on known children of Arkham activity. The bank? That's the bank, right? Arkham Asylum, City Hall. Oh, I thought one of them was the bank. What was this one? No, I. Yes, yes, I know it takes That's time. The but... statement of the century. Considering I've got at least one of my guys in the ER. Yes, just please let me know when it happens. The children of Arkham aren't going to wait on us. I suppose I can understand the truth of that. Harvey has no idea. It's impossible to tell if the children of Arkham have access to this, but if they do, any action he takes against them, they'll see coming. Are you done here, sir? Give me a minute. Not yet. I do have to warn Harvey, though. I mean, I just want to view the records. Patients committed to Arkham going back 20 years. A rather extensive list. With my father's signature as the transferring doctor. Security footage. These date back decades. Alfred, the video at the debate. It's real. This is how they found their evidence. Something Hill did gave them access. At least now I know the truth. Well, that's, not, that's never good. City Hall, record of Gotham Mayors. 
Hill had been in office for so long, it's hard to remember a time when he wasn't mayor. Look at this. Theodore Cobblepot. Deceased two weeks before the election. So it might be a possibility. Gotham Courthouse. All public records. Might be a possibility. Well, look at this. Hill got him off. Oswald's public record. None of this is right. His whole criminal history doesn't exist as far as the rest of the world is concerned. This must be what the board saw. Not a blemish in sight. Good grief. I wonder if they've cleared out all the Wayne tech. This is ridiculous, Gordon. Do you know how much all this equipment costs? We don't have the budget to replace it all. It's a risk we've got to take, Commissioner. If the children of Arkham can hack into our systems, we're completely ineffective. And you think going into situations completely blind is any better? Considering the alternative, yes. Sounds like they've got the situation under control. Good. One less problem to deal with. All right. Let's go warn Harvey. I've seen enough. I have to go warn Harvey. Keep an eye on this, Alfred, and have Lucius look into it as well. We need to find a way to lock them out. Very good, sir. <laughs> So Mayor Hill probably did not only kill the Waynes, but he probably killed what seems to be Oz's father too before the election. This man Hill had so much strokes now it's just, it's just crazy. Oh, Mr. Wayne, welcome. How you doing? You can go on in. Oh, thank you. I'm back. Yes, that's right. The back. I'll need a rental in the meantime. I mean, if you need help, I got you. Uh, Harvey? Uh, back here, Bruce. Uh, take a seat. I'll be right out. <laughs> oh, come on, not today. Stop, stop, stop. Anything hey, good? You, uh, you need some help back there? Uh, no, no, I, I'm, I'm fine. Well, it's, it's good as it's gonna get. Uh, you know, Bruce, I've been looking forward to this my entire career. The day Harvey Dent takes his official portrait as mayor of Gotham. And he looks like this. Good grief. So you can see the whole right side of his Glad teeth. you survived the trip up here, Bruce. You want to tell me what's going on? I didn't keep you waiting that long, did I? Look, don't freak out, but I think the children of Arkham are listening in on you. You're in danger. They could have tabs on everything that goes on in this office. Who you're talking to, where you're going, everything. <sighs> Damn it! God, I knew it. I knew it had to be true. Bastards! They're like cockroaches. Ew. Children of Ark can jump me. God, it's only getting worse. And it's out of control. I can't stop it. I heard Batman showed up to help. Yeah, not too late. Harvey Dent does everything by the book, to the letter of the law. But that isn't working. Sure it is. He's turning things around. Barely. Slowly. I'd like to see you do better. Watch me. Now are you gonna fix this mess? Simple. Easy. Curfews after dark. Checkpoints at every bridge. Mandatory identification cards 24-7. You're acting strange. Huh? This whole city's acting strange! This man's talking to himself. In plain sight. Sorry. S sorry about that, Bruce. I, I guess I got a little lost there. I'm probably not getting enough sleep these days. I'm here for you, bro. We're both under a lot of stress right now. We, we should be able to lean on each other. 
Strong Got you. Together, right? Got you. It's the only way. Uh, Mr. Dent? The photographer's ready for you. Thank you, Deborah. I'll be right out. Please, Bruce. Don't tell anyone about this. If anyone finds out or thinks I'm not fit to be mayor, it's all over. Your secret's safe with me, Harvey. I got you. <sighs> Thanks, Bruce. I owe you. Again. <laughs> again and again. The world owes me, man. It is what it is, you know. <sighs> See you around, Bruce. Be easy, my man. Interview with the children of Arkham's leader. I wonder how Vicky managed to score that. Hmm. Interesting. Bruce? Uh, have you seen today's copy of the Gazette? It just arrived a moment ago. It seems Miss Vale has been talking to some very interesting people. People the Batman would like to find. Do you think she would be willing to help you? She may be the only lead we have on the children of Arkham's leader. Vicky might end up giving Bruce Wayne the runaround. After all, a reporter rarely reveals her source. But an interview with Batman, that might be enough to sway her. Absolutely. After all, it did work with Mayor Hill. I can't afford to waste time with Vicky. Let's offer her a chat with Batman. Good idea, sir. Can Not being around the line? bush. Right away. Not being around the bush. I saw your story in the Gazette this morning. I want to talk. Who... who is this? Batman. Batman. I didn't realize that Batman was a fan of my work. Didn't say I was a fan. Just said I wanted to talk. I've been meaning to thank you. What you did at the debate. I'm not sure I would have made it out of there otherwise. I'd say I owe you one. Meet me at sundown. Cobblepot Park. Deal. No doubt. I just hope you're cooperative. Because if you're not, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Something might happen. I'm warning you now. I'm letting you know firsthand what might happen. <laughs> I always come down the same way. wasn't sure you were going to show. I'd admit, part of me thought it was a prank call. I'll keep my word. I said I'd be here, didn't I? Uh, good to know. So. Why you sound so scared? Batman. Told you anything about right? The obvious question. The children of Arkham seem to be your latest target. We all know their methods are extreme, but what about their message? Their leader claims that Gotham's elite have been abusing their power, often at the expense of ordinary citizens. For the record. Do you think there's any validity to what they're saying? In your opinion. Turn it off. I don't want this conversation recorded. I thought we were here for an interview. Turn it off. Fine. Their message is picking up traction. Especially since the interview. I need to know everything they told you. Does no one read anymore? It was a lot of posturing and grandiose monologuing, really. We're going to purge the city of corruption, sort of thing. Not great from an investigative standpoint, but the public will eat it up. Part of the job, you know? If that's the only reason you called me, you should really just read it yourself. They aren't trying to hide their motivations. You gave them a platform to promote themselves. You're helping them get what they want. What they want is an end to corruption. Something I've heard you claim to support as well. Unless that's all just a rumor. Where did you meet? What you trying to say? Contact you? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna stop you right there. I'm Excuse not selling me? out a source. Not even for Batman. The circumstances of that meeting... Okay, so she's not cooperating, okay. Just like this one. I'm sure you wouldn't want me telling everyone how to get a hold of you. You're putting the safety of everyone in Gotham at risk. Well, if you really care about the safety of Gotham, why aren't you looking at Bruce Wayne? 
I still want to believe he's a good guy too, but with the information that surfaced, everyone's angry. Everyone wants him to answer for what his family did. What the hell can he say? Except for you. Why haven't you gone after him yet? No way, he just slipped under your radar. But so far, no action from you against him. Bruce Wayne is innocent. He's not responsible for what his father did. Maybe not, but he still benefits from it. All those people suffered so that he could prosper up in that mansion of his. What? I don't know if you have some connection with him. Maybe there's more to this story than I realize. It's not even fair. You can't ignore the facts. Whether he intended to or not, his family has been stealing from innocent people for years. So, what are you going to do about it? What is Batman doing to protect them from Bruce Wayne? You want me to hurt the man? to know. There are bigger threats to Gotham out there. The children of Arco. I have to deal with them first. You're doing what you think is right. I get it. Good luck with the children of Arkham. I'll be sure your message gets out. Um, excuse me. <gasps> Please, Miss Vale. Think what you want about Bruce Wayne. But I need to find the children of Arkham before they hurt anyone else. You're right. You upheld your end. God, I could lose my job for this, but... Here, this is where we met for the interview. Just please don't tell anyone I gave this to you. Well, thank you. She cooperated. I didn't have to put hands on. Good enough for me. All right. Let's see what we're dealing with at the SkyTrain Depot. Almost nine o'clock at night. I come down like I do with every way. It's hilarious to me. It's empty. No sign of the children of Arkham. They may not have gone far. They should be there. Not for the moment. It means I have time to see what they've been up to. And just be careful. We don't want any surprises. I'll continue monitoring the drone feeds from here. Thanks. Go and have a look around. Let's, uh... There's a body here. Likely the work of the children of Arkham. I'm gonna look around, see what they've been up to. Now, before we do that, I'm going to stop right here. I'm going to give, because I don't know what's next. And I don't know how long it's going to be. So, I'm going to give it time. So, we're going to stop right here. And we're going to go to a part three with this one. So, part three underway. Till next time. Peace. Love 100. Yurt.